Hey besties, it's your girl Catherine. Welcome to my channel, welcome back to my channel. So today is a little bit of a different video and this is about clothes, clothing haul. I bought a lot of things on Amazon because here's the thing, I hate shopping in like in person and it's because of my body dysmorphia. Let's let's just be honest here. I'm a mid-sized girl, I got some body space and every time I go in the mirrors and like the little fluorescent lighting at the stores and the department stores and at the mall, I get a little sad when things don't fit. So I got a whole bunch of things on Amazon <laughs> to try out. I will link everything down in the description below so you guys can know if these clothes are worth it or not and what they look on me. I normally like to upsize my clothes, so I, I bought everything in an extra large. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started and try these clothes. This is like my first ever clothing haul in the entire world because I normally don't buy clothes. And I actually, I'm wearing this top that I got at Target and I totally forgot I got it until I recently looked at it today. I was like, hmm, I gotta wear, I gotta wear something cute for a video. I did get some stuff for like fall, and in the future if I ever do need to work, I got some like, you know, some sweaters here and there, a little professional clothes, and then some clothes for like going out and things like that, and like some casual things. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so here's the first one. This is the Women Tank Top Summer Sleeveless Basic Cami Top with like a little drawstring moment there. Okay, so I tied it, and I feel like I look like a pizza. No? It's the bi dysmorphia talking, but I don't hate her, honestly. Like, if I want to, like, go out and do something fun, like a brunch moment, what do you guys think? I don't know. I <laughs> This is, like, so weird to, like, do because it's, like, my first time, but I'm just wearing, like, white shorts just to do the bare minimum there, but, I mean, it's not bad. I feel like I am, like, more of, like, a box. I feel like you have to have more of, like, a bustier, like, some boobage right there, you know what I'm saying? But... I don't hate it. I don't hate it. Maybe I'm wearing it wrong, but I am wearing just like a black bra underneath just to make things look a little bit decent, right? Okay, I did get this in other colors. Let's see what they look like. Okay, next up is the blue one. I feel like this one gives me more like more shape in my opinion, even though you can kind of see like the, the side fat here, but that's okay. Um, I don't, I don't hate her. But I feel like I was thinking that it was gonna be like a lighter blue in my opinion. The picture just makes it look like it looks like it's a nice sky light blue while this is more of like a denim blue. Um, I feel like I'm a little being boozled here guys. <laughs> but I, I don't hate it. Uh, also the texture is kind of like cotton by the way. Yeah, that's my bra strap. And it's not, not like a satin finish, it's just like cotton, like a cotton t-shirt. This is around like $14. It's not bad, especially if you want to like have like a little like going out type of clothing. Okay, next up is the woman's floral chiffon blouse v-neck bat wing short sleeve summer top shirt. Okay, first off, this is an extra large. I actually changed into these denim high-waisted shorts just to make it look a little bit more appealing than like the regular shorts I was wearing earlier. So like in the picture, it just looks a lot cuter. Maybe it's because of my size that doesn't look right, but Hmm, she's a little chic. I don't know. I would honestly wear this like in the office with like some work pants, you know what I'm saying? But like also like if I'm going to like a park, this is nice. And I also would probably wear this to film videos. Cause I mean, like it's like cute. Like I'm trying to imitate the way, like if you put a belt right here and then like, like a little flowy here. But maybe I'm bunching it up too much. Maybe I'm like overdoing it. Cause this is what it looks like now. Cause if you were to wear it like this, it's just like, oh, it's like flowy. Maybe like something to wear over like a bathing suit. But like when you tuck it in, it's supposed to be kind of like chic. You know what I'm saying? Like a little, like a little chic there, you know, like overfilled. But I mean, extra large, not bad. Also the fabric, it feels like it's a little cheap when I first put it on. But then when you like sit into it, it's actually really nice. It's flowy. This was $20 in my size. But not bad, not bad. Definitely think that you can like wear this like, no, it's like a multi-purpose type of shirt. All right, next shirt. This is the same style, but different color. And when I was looking at the red, it looked a little bit like a less of a dark red in my opinion. But honestly, I feel like a clown. Like, no shame. 
no shame like i thought this would be like my thing because it has like a little little floral moment there like a little like hawaiian or like tropical moment but like i feel a little weird with this color like i might have to choose a different color but like if you wear it like this it looks really baggy maybe like a maternity wear i'm not gonna lie you guys i was actually anticipating this one the most but like i don't know if it's my favorite just because the color is very bright like the red looked a lot more darker on line than it did in person like it's really bright maybe it's my lighting but like she's like having a moment i might keep it though not gonna lie like this is just like a little bit different than what i have maybe put some jewelry here Mhm. Mm next up we have the sleeveless v-neck t-shirt tunic in this color like i feel like i'm a mom like this is something my mom would wear because i don't know because the girl that's wearing it it looks a lot looser but this is also an extra large maybe i should have sized up more i mean it's basic it's simple i like the color a lot but i don't know how i feel about like it might feel like it's like a tiny bit tight not tight it's like it fits but like i wish it was a little bit more looser so i definitely recommend if you have like my body size and you want more looser definitely size up with this one i would say it's like a four out of ten in my opinion just because of the sleeves it just looks looser in the picture the v-shape in the photo looks a lot more sharper but this one right here is just it's not sharp like it's not like it's just a little like Maybe it's my neck. I don't know. I'm not really feeling her. Fall is just around the corner, besties. So I got the fall long sleeve v-neck t-shirt sleepwear tunic top blouse shirt. And I don't know how I feel about it because it's actually supposed to not be a dress. But I feel like I'm wearing one. It fits, okay, for as a person who has a hard time finding clothes that fits. It fits, okay? very basic i feel like if you have no nothing to wear and you don't know what to wear this might be it the materials uh stretchy i definitely think i if i got a large it would be a little like form-fitting this one is a little bit loose but i mean it's not bad i wish it was just like all the way up i feel like i'm in like 2016 college freshman year and I'm going out to get drinks with like buddies because this is like our school colors. Okay, for functionality, I rate it like an 8 out of 10 because it fits, it works, it's easy to put on, like grab and go. Like I would wear this to work, okay? Like this is a nice work shirt, nothing too revealing. It's covered, it's modest, it's professional. And if you just like have it down and just wear like work pants, you're good to go. But like style wise, it's not my favorite. I would probably say it's like a three out of 10, a three and a half, just because I don't hate it for what it is, but I just wish it filled more, like more filled. Like this right here, it just looks like I borrowed my older sister's clothes. Next up, we have the women's off shoulder sweater. And this one is the knit jumper, the knit color. So this is technically supposed to be like off the shoulder ooh, scandalous i definitely think this will be fun for like the office or see here's the thing for the office you pull the shoulder up versatile yet friendly but if you want to go a little bit like after five o'clock p.m getting drinks with the co-workers just a little shoulder okay just a little shoulder you could probably do it like both ways Ooh, hold on hold on guys definitely don't hate it i think i should have got a lighter color in my opinion this is dark khaki extra large honestly i'm kind of vibing it the more i look into the viewfinder the more i'm liking it because i love fall anything and it's giving me like cozy vibes it's not scratchy at all the fabric's really nice you guys it's like it feels like i'd pay like 50 bucks somewhere to go get it at like a department store i think this one's like a win i honestly for like fall if i'm having like an autumn girl vibe this is like 9 out of 10 the fabric's nice i can show a little shoulder if i wanted to not bad and this is extra large yes it's a little spin around i like this one okay yeah and it's like comforting it's not like too tight on the sides so it gets like it gets loose here and then it fits really nicely this would be really good for like thanksgiving meals or like when you're like out going to like your family's house and then you have to dress appropriate because of your conservative family this is what you wear but just pop a little shoulder there yes i don't know this gives me like a southern twang into it like this clothes is like something i see a lot where people <laughs> near me wear during the fall time like if you live in the south and you don't have a lot of sweaters and you want to buy something on amazon try this out not too bad 
9 out of 10 guys. Alright, this is the last style and this is called the Women's Off Shoulder Sweater V-neck Long Sleeve Loose Pullover Knit Jumper. And the way that they're wearing it looks a lot better than the way I'm wearing it right now. I just put it all over my clothes. But this looks like a jacket. Like I'm gonna go skiing or something like that, but now I'm gonna pull it down a tiny bit because that's how the person was wearing it. So the fabric, amazing, very puffy, but I don't know how they pulled it down. I like it. I like it a lot. It's like fluffy, it's like a little cozy. I also got this in black as well, but I feel like I should get it in more colors. Extra large, the fabric is really nice, not scratchy, it doesn't feel cheap. It's really soft and nice. Okay, <laughs> this is what it looks like. So it's supposed to be off the shoulder, but I feel like this is going to be hard, especially like clothes like this. It's hard to keep things on the shoulder, in my opinion. Here, this is what it looks like. A little baggy, but if you like baggy clothes, you're really going to like this one. I think it's really cute. I would say 8.5 out of 10, because the fabric's just really nice, but I feel like it's, it might be a little bit too big, but I feel like that's the purpose of this fabric, just because it's supposed to look big. And also a little bit like front and back. What are we thinking? Do we hate her? Do we love her? I definitely think this is really nice for the office as well, especially because you're covered, but you're also warm. It's actually like 90 degrees here, so it's a little warm to me, but I think the one thing I will say, the point that's getting take off, taken off is because you have to keep it technically on the shoulder. It's not going to always look picture perfect, so if you have really nice shoulders, you're going to really enjoy this one. Alright, this is the black one. I feel like this one just is a little bit more baggier than the other one. I don't know. Let, like, hold on. It feels a little more baggier. The texture is still the same, but the black one versus like the light beige color. I feel like this one keeps a little bit more at the shoulders easier. I'm not sure you guys, the more I look at the black one, the more I feel like I'm just like getting sucked in into like this orb of nothingness. Like I'm just like a, a black hole. That's what I feel like. But yeah. Hmm. This one I'd probably give a 7 out of 10 because I'm not a really big fan of the color, in my opinion. I'm probably not wearing it correctly. I feel like when I edit this video, I'm going to have like super body dysmorphia because I'm just like, wow, is that what I really look like in those clothes? But this is my haul. I feel like someone who is mid-size, it's a little bit difficult to find clothes, especially online and especially on like those really nice websites that have like clothes from like small to like extra large but the extra large is really like a large so then you're like oh shoot I gotta return it that's me that's literally me but I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video I will have all the links down to all the clothes that I got if you guys are interested in it because I want to start getting into clothes I want to be a fashionista but I have no style so I mean you guys can kind of tell because I picked all those clothes <laughs> anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video <laughs> let me know down below what you guys want to see next for me and I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.